Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we are going to discuss about crash rounding in Odoo 17 POS. Odoo point of sale has a built-in feature for crash rounding to streamline the transaction and reduce the need for exact change. So what is cash rounding? Cash rounding rounds the total bill amount of a sale to the nearest uh, denominations, for example, nearest 5 cents, 10 cents and suitable for a cash payment. This eliminates the hustle of dealing with the small change for a customer and cashier. So in order to manage with the cash rounding, you can just dive into the point of sale. Under the configuration settings, we have a feature called cash rounding. So as you just drag down here, you can just enable the cash rounding that defines the smallest coinage of the currency used to pay by the cash. So if you want to just manage the cash rounding for cash methods only, you can just enable this field and you can configure the cash rounding under the configuration. So here you can see that we have just configured the uh, cash rounding uh, such as half up, down and up as well as we can also just set the cash up or down for taxes also. So here just consider the cash rounding as half up and we are using the rounding precision as 0 0.1 and here we can just use different rounding strategies such as adding a rounding line and we can also just modify the tax. So for the time being we are just going to use at a rounding line. This is because uh, for applying the cash rounding for a restaurant, restaurant the strategy can be applied only uh, be add a rounding line. So here we will be using the profit account as cash difference gain and loss account as cash difference loss. And you can also set the rounding method over here. Likewise, you can also set different method as down uh, over here and uh, up also. So we have already configured that. Now let's move on to the dashboard and here you can see different sessions over here. So you can uh, use any one of the session over here. So currently I'm going to use the session that is a restaurant. So in order to manage the cash rounding for the session restaurant, you can just click on three icon and click on edit where you can just configure, I mean, edit the configuration settings of this particular session. As you just drag down here, you would be able to find uh, we have uh, different cash rounding method. And let me change the method into half up later on you can save the changes now let's move on to the session um, to open and let's see how the total is changing upon the cash rounding and here you can just go to a new session and you can just make the orders over here so let's open the session and let's create an order for this so i'm going to choose a bacon burger as a product where you can see that 8.63 is the uh, cost of the product where you can just uh, order this item and click on payment and here uh, we are just going to make the payment by using cash method as you just choose a cash method and here you can see that we have just set uh, the uh, rounding by half up and using 0 0.1 the amount has now just changed into 8.60 and as you just want uh, to hear, you can see that the total amount actually is 8.63, but that will be round and set to 8.63. Now we can just make the payment. Uh, let's close the tab. Now we can just create the other uh, yeah, uh, cash rounding method for other orders. So for that, you can just move on to the back end. And now let's click on uh, the three icons and go to the edit button where you just uh, go to the configuration settings and uh, change the rounding method into uh, down and as you just get into the internal link of this first we have to save this and you can just get into the internal link of the rounding um, and you would be able to find the precision that is used so here we are just go going to use the rounding precision as 0 0.5 now let's move on to the dashboard and you can just click on continue selling and now let's make an order for the product where the product has a price of three, i mean um 3.45 uh, for chicken curry sandwich so let me use the product over here let's order that and make payment by using the cash uh restaurant so as you just uh use the cash uh method and um using the rounding precision you can see that the rounding is now just adjusted to three because we have just rounded with 0 0.5 now we can just uh, make the payment uh, for that you can just close this 
now let's uh, go to the back end and use the other method so uh, in the three dots you can just go to the edit button where you can just click the uh, configuration settings and here you can just go to the cache rounding and let's change into up and let's save the changes that we have made in the configuration settings and we can just get into the internal link of the cache rounding as up and let's find the position that is one and later on let's go to the dashboard and let's create a new order where uh, we can just choose the product as Expresso. So I'm going to choose the product as Expresso and you can find the product price is set to 5.41 where we can just order uh, this item and click on payment and we can just create the uh, cash payments and uh, here you can see that as we just set the rounding position as one that is just uh, rounded up to six over here and we can just close this uh, tab and well we have just made the payment over here so from this uh, we can just conclude that the rounding method determines how the rounding should happen and uh, POS offers different uh, option for rounding like round up always around the total up to the next uh, nearest domination and round down always around the total down to the nearest denomination and half up rounds up if the decimal part is greater than 0 0.5 otherwise rounds down so i hope this video clarifies how to uh, make use of the cash rounding methods in odoo 17 pos if you want odoo customization or odoo tutorials feel free to contact cybrosis as always Stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.